From the birth of a pioneer city. Forging their own path. To the blossoming of a tech capital. It's grown really rapidly in a short amount of time. Seattle and its fashion have many stories to tell. So this is the earliest um, piece that we have in the exhibit, 1850s, 1860s. Um, it's a maternity wrapper. Mohai's Seattle style fashion function will have you rethinking local clothing trends as it defines the many looks of the Northwest. Those that originated here and others brought here, often at great expense. And we have a story of a woman in the exhibit that uh, as early as 1907 was taking buying trips from Seattle to Paris to bring back things for her store. You'll see the origins of a retail empire. So this is the Nordstrom shoe case. Shoes from when Nordstrom was just a shoe store. There's outdoor wear, including the original puffy coat invented by Eddie Bauer back in the 1930s. Uh, we have a bunch of innovative companies that have really been at the forefront. And Kurt Cobain's extraordinary, ordinary sweater and hat. It's kind of a banal sweater and there's a little like stain on the front of it, historic dirt we call it. It's a journey through our collective history because what we wear tells the story of who we are. Okay, the Seattle Style exhibit opens on Saturday and it runs right till mid-October. You know, this area has contributed so many great additions to fashion from Ivor's hat to Eddie Vedder's flannel and Macklemore's faux fur. That's why I've created the Ivor McElvetter Collection. Perfect for any occasion, especially this one. All right, what song makes